Welcome to Thai Kitchen with Brenda. Ka. Today I'm going to show you how to make boat noodles. Nah, or in Thai we call Koi Tiu Rue. Nah, ka. Koi Tiu Rue um, believed to be originated from uh, Panakon Si Ayutthaya, or most people know as uh, Ayutthaya. Nah, ka. That is the old capital of Thailand, and uh, it's about uh, 45 minutes to an hour drive north of Bangkok. Nah, to uh, Ayutthaya. Nah, ka. As the name indicates. Boat noodles were sold from boats in Bangkok's canals since the 19th century. Today, boat noodles are still sold around the canals in Bangkok. If you go and visit a floating market around Thailand, you will definitely see one car. So today, I'm going to share with you how to make Kwe Tiu Rue. This is going to be the original recipe. So let's go and take a look at the ingredients. And the ingredients for this um, Kwe Tiu Rue recipe, na ka, what I have here are the uh, bones that, that I'm going to make the uh, soup. Na ka. I have pork bones and also I have the beef and neck bones here. Na ka. I also have uh, palm sugar and also the uh, um, white cooking onions. And the this is the uh, seasoning for the Kwe Tiu Rue. Na ka. So it's called the uh, Gosko and uh, you can get this one at the local Asian superstore right? and also Amazon.ca This is the beef ball, right? this is Vietnamese beef ball and one of these I cut it in four like this right? I'm going to add this one in the soup and I also have this um, beef liver right? The same thing with this anchor uh, meat right? I got this one at um, Costco with this one is uh, optional. This is the uh, tripe, the beef tripe. I already cook it and I cut it in small pieces like this. In the uh, original Kutiurua, this is what they added to uh, beef ball, um, liver, uh, meat, and also the uh, this tripe. Uh, and um, over here, of course, I have these uh, noodles. Uh, these noodles, which I soak it in uh, tap, hot tap water for four minutes uh, to make it a little bit softer. This is what it like, look like right? to make it a little bit softer. So it's easy for um, when you cook it. Right? I'm going to show you later on how to cook it. Right? I also have this morning glory or the ong choy. Right? This is what ong choy look like. Right? And of course I have this um, bean sprout too. Right? I also wash it and put it in here. So with this Cilantro, green onions, and a sawtooth cilantro. Okay, this is what the sawtooth cilantro look like. It have the tooth in here. That's why they call sawtooth cilantro. Okay? So I'm going to uh, chop this one up. I also have this um, stem of cilantro. So I cut it off like this. I'm going to add it into the soup. Okay? This recipe okay, is for six uh, servings. To make the noodle soup bones, okay? First of all, you have to add 16 cups of water into the large pot like this and then wash the pork bones and the beef next bone uh -huh. Add into the boiling water Let it boil for at least 2 minutes uh -huh. And then you can see that on the top of the soup you will see that the proteins and the fat that floating on top of the soup you have to scoop it out uh -huh. Scoop all of them out Reduce the heat down to simmer cover it up and let your soup bone cook at least for 45 minutes or an hour. Okay. Then you add cooking onions, cilantro stem, beef balls and uh, seasoning, the kutil real seasoning uh -huh, into the soup and cover it up and then let it simmer for another 5 minutes. Okay. Condiments for the boat noodles or kutiwuru, what I have here. This is fresh chili, fresh garlic and shallot in vinegar. So I blend it like this. And also this is roasted and ground Thai chili here. This is the garlic fried garlic and oil. So we're going to put this one on top of the noodles before we serve it but these two you can add it to your noodles when you eat it all these uh, three condiments uh, I already made video on this one uh, so if you would like to know how to make this uh, please click up here uh, so for the recipe uh, up here uh, crispy chicharron uh, this is what the chicharron look like so we put it in here and it's very nice and crispy eat it with the boat noodles uh. 
Mm. I hope you're enjoying it. Before we cook our noodles, in the medium pot, you add about 12 cups of water to the pot and then bring to boil. In a noodle strain, add the noodles into the noodle strain and then dip it in the boiling water for 5 seconds. Remove it and add the cooked noodles into the noodles bowl. Then you add morning glory and bean sprouts into the noodle strain and dip it in uh, boiling water. Remove it, add it to your noodles bowl. Then you add uh, one teaspoon of fried garlic oil on top of your noodles, just like this. Ka. For the beef liver, na ka, I'm going to cook it a little bit by adding it into the noodle strain like this. And then I'm going to dip it in the hot soup for 30 seconds. Uh -huh. Remove it, add it to the noodles bowl. For the raw beef, I'm just going to add it on top of the noodles, just like this. Na ka. And then I'm going to pour hot soup on top of the uh, noodles and grind it with the uh, cilantro, green onions, and sauté cilantro. Okay? So here you are, your kwete rua, or both noodles, is ready to be served. Okay? I hope that you like it. So I add a little bit of this roasted and ground Thai chili, and uh, this fresh chili, garlic, salad, in vinegar. Okay? I'm going to add it in like this. It's, I like it hot, so here you go. Oh. <laughs> A little bit hard work, but smells so delicious. Oh, oh heaven. Oh, heaven on earth. Mmm. Here's the river. Mmm. But the pretty. It's very good. Excellent. Try that and let me know. Uh -huh. See you next time. Bye.